Uh, hi everyone, how you doing? Hello everyone! How are you doing tonight? My name's Ghost Wolf Alpha, back again with another stream tonight. I hope you're all doing pretty well. Well, I'm sorry I didn't stream last night. I ate something bad and it just wrecked, just wrecked my stomach. But don't worry, I'm feeling a whole lot better today. And also gave gave me a chance to have wait for the bit rate f for a good good two, good di couple of days t for the bit rate to cycle. And we're back to at least a somewhat normal bit rate, even though it's saying unstable it's in where I was having it before. Well, what we're gonna be doing next, um, doing tonight is Star Trek Online. I know it's been a hot minute or two. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, last stream, the bit rate was just horrible. I'm surprised that I even was able to stream somewhat. But, but what? But anyway, new day, new stream. Got myself new. Also, got myself some good news. I got myself new glasses today. That's right. I can see a whole lot better now. Still can't aim worth anything though. <laughs> anyway, let's get started, shall we? Okay, come on, game. Pop up. Thank you. Okay, as we as we last were on Star Trek Online, we were about to start the start. One second, let me show you. About to start the Cardassian struggle arc here. Might as well. S oh. Hmm. Didn't I know that? Do I want to go after it? No? Not right now, anyway. Oh. Back up. And let's... Now let's go on to Deep Space Nine here. And beam directly to Ops. Also, while we're at it, I'm gonna start up some music. Give me a second to get the thing all up operational here. Come on. Do I have to alt-tab on my main computer? Well, it looks like it. Oh well. So, sorry for the whole... whole thing decided to go choppy here. That's what happens when you alt-tab. Anyway. Let's go with... just some retro wave for tonight. Okay. I have a feeling I I mucked up somewhere. Let's go back to my ship. Okay. Let's just beam on there. Okay, give me one second. I have to check something here. Okay, let's. I th think I was in the right spot, but hey, I never. Hey, I could be wrong though. No.
Okay. Weird. Oh, there you are. How can I help you? I was told to report to you. Welcome to Deep Space Nine, and thank you for coming so quickly. During the occupation of Bajor, many sacred artifacts were stolen and studied. After the bajoran cardassian Treaty was signed in 2371, these artifacts were supposed to be returned. However, the Obsidian Order, the Cardassian military intelligence branch, opposed the treaty and apparently hid at least some of these artifacts in their warehouses. We know this because we have been contacted by the Cardassian government. There is a faction among the Cardassians called the True Way that rejects the treaty with the Federation. This organization infiltrated a defunct Obsidian Order facility and stole an Orb of the Prophets. These orbs are precious to our people. They have been given to us by the Prophets. They possess mysterious and unusual powers. Many of them grant visions to supplicants. We believe the true way are operating out of a base in the Badlands. We would like you to travel to the Badlands and attempt to recover the orb on behalf of the Bajoran people. All right, I'll track down those responsible for stealing the orb of the prophets. Then. How can I help you? Okay, next up. The true way has stolen an orb the Obsidian Order failed to return after the war. Although we don't know for certain where they have taken it, we have been getting dozens of reports of raiders hitting civilian ships near the Badlands. Starfleet Intelligence believes the raids are related to true way activity in that region. We know that area is a haven for smugglers and criminals of all types. It stands to reason that the True Way are using it to avoid capture as well. They may even be using some of the McKee bases that were abandoned before the Cardassian War. We believe that the Badlands are therefore the most likely place for the True Way to be hiding the stolen orb. I know the Badlands are dangerous, but I have complete confidence in the ship and her crew. Okay. How can I help you? And let's just transwarp there. And begin the mission. Okay, we've arrived at the Badlands, sir. Our intelligence indicates that this is an area of heavy True Way activity. However, the plasma storage of gravitational anomalies interfere with our sensors. We will need to search the Badlands for signs of the True Way occupation. I'm receiving a distress call. To any ships in the vicinity, I am under attack by a group of Cardassian ships identifying themselves as the True Way. Please, render assistance immediately. Okay, set course with the freighter. Cardassian ships appeared out of nowhere. 
They ordered me to surrender in the name of Gull Kardec in the true way. Okay, what did you do? My freighter is obviously no match for them. I tried to get away, but they disabled my engines. They were just about to board me, I believe, when you arrived. If you're looking for the true way, I would head for that anomaly. Thank you. I'd recommend you repair your engines and exit the area. Let's get to that anomaly and see what's going on there. Scan it. You have fallen into our trap. And now, never locate our base. Nice try. A free item. appears to be some kind of tear the fabric of the space time continuum. It, appear, it appears to be dormant. Or see, it appears dormant, but I believe it could be wide to become a portal. I'm detecting traces of orb energy in the area. I believe I might be able to follow it. Okay, hail Commander Sarish. Sarish here. We, look, we have located a trail of orb energy we are about to follow. We could use some backup. Acknowledged. I will be along in the Defiant shortly. Thank you, Commander. That moon. Oh, orbital platforms. Or take those out. for comfort. Scans indicate this is a true way moon base. I have located an appropriate place to beam in. Okay, let's beam down. Okay, we have transported inside the true way base. I have been detecting the detecting orb energy coming from somewhere nearby. I'm also detecting a number of Cardassian life signs. Looks like we'll have to fight our way through to the orb. Just go. So, want the shotgun. Let's just put the mortar there.
just want to double check something. This is yeah, that's just bound to account. So I'm taking take a random round weapon, stun pistol. Okay, that'll work. Items Finny Box Okay, some armor which I'm gonna equip that since it's better than what I have right now. Also Do a little bit of upgrading on my on my my first officer here. Wait, I have this. My scans indicate that Gold Kardec has sealed himself in his office, but I believe we can override the lockout at the security console at, at that on that podium. Okay then. <clears throat> Hi Yoza, and sorry about not responding soon soon, but okay, have fun lurking. And also rest up. Because you being tired is not conductive to anything. Say not conductive to any good times. Greetings. I am Gol Kardec. This orb is the property of the Cardassian government. The true Cardassian government. The true way. And you can't have it. Guards! Fools, you will never defeat me. Decided to run, I see. Okay, let's lower the force field. <clears throat> Download the data. Regarding that other matter you speak of, 
while we certainly share your detest for the Federation and are willing to assist you in opposing them in theory, there are certain territorial issues we will have to iron out before we feel comfortable committing military forces. Perhaps we can arrange a meeting in the usual place? Okay, let's download that message. Second. Okay. Let's take that orb. Here, it's beamed to our ship. And let's get out of here. We've escaped the old gold cartek has escaped though and we're about we're to tr attempt to track him down i will be along in the defiant momentarily and may the prophet smile upon you and on you commander looks like i arrived just in time Ionizing radiation, which should interact with the plasma wake illuminating it. The illumination won't won't last very long, though. So we'll have to hurry. Okay, make the modifications and emit radiation on my command. I got a feeling it's with the anomaly. <laughs> Scans indicate this anomaly has opened a portal leading to the so-called mirror universe, a parallel dimension adjacent to ours. Hold on, sensors detecting ships emerges from the portal. Shields up! Those look like mirror universe ships. Yep!
out. Oh, that was a close one. Congratulations on your recovery of the orb from Gul Kardec. We request that you return the orb to the temple in Hathon on Bajor. I'm afraid that we have not seen the last of Gul Kardec. But for now, the people of Bajor will be elated at the return of an orb we thought lost forever. Right. Good work. Right. How can Congratulations, I Commander. You have recovered the orb of possibilities from Gul Kardec. No doubt, you are being pursued by true way forces. You must return the orb to the temple in Hathon. I have notified Vedic Kryn. She is waiting for you in the temple. Alrighty then. How can I help you? Here, says they're all grouped together. Here, <laughs> deep space land, the wormhole, and Bajor. There, begin Jabberwocky. We have arrived in the Bajor system, sir. We are, sir. We're, de sir, detecting Cardassian warp signatures. It's a true way. They're hailing us. Okay, on screen. I am Gul Mutak of the Kriegar, adjutant general to Gul Kardec. You are carrying stolen property belonging to the true way. Lower your shields and prepare to be boarded. Are you insane? We are in orbit of Bajor. We could have ships here in a moment. Okay, he's cut off communications and powered up weapons. What are your orders, sir? Hail Deep Space Nine! Sarah's here. Commander, the tr we have been ambushed by the True Way in orbit of Bajor. In the orbit of Bajor? But how could they? <sighs> Nerve of the. Sorry, I'm okay. I will borrow the Defiant and be there momentarily. Thanks, we'll hold out as long as we can. One piece. Let's teach these cardies a lesson. 
I appreciate your zeal, Commander, but let's not get carried away. <laughs> Take on the Krieger. I will remain in orbit while you return the orb, okay. just in case. Okay, thank you, Commander. Let's beam down. Okay, Fedekrin indicates she's waiting for you at the temple, and let's bring it there. Okay, we're a wee bit too far. Greetings. Okay. Do you seek the wisdom of the prophets? Looking for... I'm looking for Vedic Krin. Vedic Krin is in the temple office, just to the east of here. Okay, thank you. Oh, there you are. How may I help you? I'm here to return this orb to the temple. Wonderful. The prophets have smiled upon us this day. What was lost has been returned to us. You have done a great service for the Bajoran people today, and we are most grateful. It was an honor and a privilege to carry this burden. Please, place the orb upon the altar. With pleasure, Vedicrin. Okay, let's see what's gonna happen. I have returned the orb of possibilities. <laughs> The service rendered is not the service desired. What? What does not belong cannot be returned. I don't understand. What has been returned does not belong. We must travel backward. When we gaze in the mirror, we see our faces as others do, but reversed. Your task abides. You have recovered an orb. Now you must return it. As you must return. Okay. I... Jeez, we... Got the wrong orb, maybe? <laughs> 
I would be honored to know what the prophets shared with you, if you are willing. Sometimes their visions can be very confusing, and I have some experience interpreting them. Okay, it was very cryptic, but they seem to suggest this is not their orb, that I must return it elsewhere. Elsewhere? But it is an orb of the prophets. Where else could it belong? <sighs> Unless... Are you familiar with the so-called Mirror Universe? I know very little about it myself, but there is a book on that table over there by a Vedic Eth describing his experiences. Perhaps it can guide you. Okay, thank you, Vedicrin. And the book is right here. Okay, I've been fascinated with the existence of this so-called mirror universe ever since our recent contact with it. I have interviewed the emissary Colonel Kira and others about their experience with the mirror universe. But many questions remain. It seems the mirror universe has prophets, but are they the same prophets? There's no mention of a celestial temple, and no, and certainly the mirror Benjamin Sisko was no emissary. I shall petition for the Vedic Assembly for permission to enter this enter the Mirror Universe. Uh, the Vedic Assembly has denied my request. Besides, the debate about doctrine and theology and the deciding factor was political. The Federation has quarantined any access to the Mirror Universe and Bajor is seeking membership. I have continued my research by interviews, but my questions remain unanswered. I fear no choice but to renounce my seat in the assembly and pursue entrance to the Mary universe on my own. I don't have the technological prowess to create one of those multi-dimensional devices myself, but I have an engineer friend who owes me a favor. I am lucky to be alive. I managed to cross over to the Mary universe, but Terragnor, as they call Deep Space Nine, has been taken over by the Terran Rebellion. They're using it as a base of power to attempt to reassert their control over the Bajor sector. The Jorans are not trusted and used mostly for mining and ore processing. A cruel irony given Bajor's history in both universes, but I was able to join with, so with the Bajoran workers and get some of my questions answered. The Bajor Bajorans of the Mary Universe are much like us as it sounds if their prof as if their prophets are sim are most similar. They even have orbs such as we have. However, to them, the Celestial Temple is myth or metaphor, not a physical place such as ours. I do not know if this because it has a, simply hasn't been discovered, or if the prophets of that universe have sealed themselves away for some reason. The only way to find out is either to cross over with a spaceship, or to somehow procure one of there. Procure one there. I received a curious message from somebody from the Mary Universe offering me assistance. Note, shortly after making this entry, the deck Eeth disappeared and was never heard from again. Okay. Sarah's here. We believe this orb is from the Mirror Universe. We could pa I think we could pass it into the through the anomaly we found earlier. Acknowledged. Be careful. The Mirror Universe is known to be more treacherous than our universe. And you will be cut off from any support here. I appreciate the concern, Commander, but I think we'll be fine. Okay. Yep, and beam me up and set course for the Badlands. Oh, so this is just great. We have to backtrack. <laughs> Sarish here. What is your status? We have injured the Badlands and are heading towards the anomaly. Acknowledged. Keep comm lines open as long as possible. Acknowledged. We have limited intelligence on the Mirror Universe. But from what we know, it appears the Terran Rebellion spread from Terok Nor, eventually forming a new empire. 
The Terran Empire has reoccupied Bajor. I believe this Captain Lita is the administrator of the Bajor Sector. I am Gul Haneri of the Torn, Chief Tactical Advisor to Gul Kardec of the True Way. You are not welcome here. Lower your shields and prepare to be boarded. Red alert. Activate the portal, portal by bombarding, bombarding it with tachyon radiation. Alright, make the necessary modifications to the deflector dish. And let's get in range. Let's go through. Her. 
sir. We are cleared to warp to Bajor. Let's get out of here. Just have to wait for it to load. Okay. <laughs> Okay, we've arrived on Bajor in the Mirror Universe. From what I have been able to pick up on Com Chatter, Bajor was reconquered by the Terran Empire and is occupied by them again. We should be on our guard. Yeah, we should. Oh, ambush! Sir, those appear to be true race soldiers. Could they have followed us through the portal? I believe it's more likely they were gold Kardex troops waiting for us. Anyway, let's talk to that gardener. I'm very busy. What do you want? What do you do? What does it look like I'm doing? Microsurgery? I get my hands dirty, and I show farmers how to grow crops. We have a botanist, but he's one of those ivory tower scientific types that wouldn't know a hoe from a rake. I wanted to be an engineer, but when the Terrans retook Bajor from the Klingon Cardassian Alliance, opportunities suddenly dried up. So I fell back on the family tradition of gardening. No matter how many times Bajor gets conquered, it always seems to be a cultural backwater that relies on manual labor. We live in harmony with our world, just as the prophets intended, whether we like it or not. Okay. Oh, well, I got myself an idea of how everything looks. And that isolated certain sections of the the city. Gulkardek was right. Oh, hello. You are formidable, but pitifully predictable. Terran forces attack the invaders! I want them alive! Guards! Guards! We will meet again soon. <coughs> ah. You, you have interfered with my plans for the last time. Not permitted here. A 
A changeling? This is not your affair. Ew, this is not good. Of course it decides to go, go that route. <laughs> this <laughs> thank you I feel much better but a changeling here we only have stories in any event what was the purpose for your visit I've come to return your orb the Orb of Possibilities? But that was lost decades ago, during the first occupation of Bajor. However did you come by it? Never mind. The Prophets teach us not to look at their workings too closely. Don't just stand there. Place it on the altar. You're most welcome. Before we do... Complications. Namely, some agents have interfered with my plans. They have stolen the Orb of Possibilities. I assume they have returned it to the Bajorans by now. Fortunately, the anomaly remains stable. I was able to retreat to the Mirror Universe where I have taken shelter with my Terran allies. However, I believe they are waiting for my return. Therefore, I need you to meet with Dumatsu Khan at the facility in the Devil system in my stead. Coordinates are attached. Okay. Some information for later. I have returned the orb of, poss of possibilities. Again. We are most grateful. We had thought the orb lost forever. You have restored the balance. Your enemies lie in wait. They want to prevent your return. But we shall restore the balance as you did. You have returned our orb. Now you must return. Well, hello. Sir, what just happened? We you opened the orb the orb case and suddenly everything went white and we appeared on the jacks in orbit of Bajor. And we appeared to be back in our own universe. Well, I believe the mere prophets returned to us, and I must consult with Vedicrin with the, about this. Greetings. I did not see you enter the temple. I believe the Mirror Prophets returned me here? Indeed. I know little of the Mirror Prophets, but if they are like ours, then this is a great honor. Rarely do the Prophets interfere so directly. I take it your mission was a success? 
Yes, the orb is back in its proper place. Then you have the gratitude of two Bajors. May the prophets continue to smile upon you. Thank you, Betacrin. And let's beam up. So, Gul Kardec was a changeling. This does not bode well. An alliance between the True Way and the Alpha Dominion could prove disastrous for the Alpha and Beta Quadrants. However, the Orb has been returned to the Mirror Universe, and you have returned to ours. Nevertheless, we must stop this alliance before they can do any further damage. We shall analyze the pad you retrieved to see if we find this Ketracel White factory. Okay, um, let's get some personal shields. How can Congratulations, I Commander. The pad you discovered on Galkar deck revealed the location of a secret facility in the Alpha Quadrant. There appears to be some kind of alliance between the True Way and the Dominion. We cannot allow them to join forces. Okay, let's get out of here and... How can I help you? Go to the Devil System. And since the ads are starting soon, I'm going to take the long way. Okay, ads have started now. So, I'm going to take the long way there, instead of transwarping. thing to put in my bar here. And here we are. Now, we still got some time left on the ads, so I'm gonna give myself a drink because I'm out. So, I'll be right back, everyone.
And I'm back. Okay. Now that's Deep Space Encounter, which we don't want to go to right now, so let's begin the factory here. Sir, so we arrived in the Devo system at the quarters Gold Cardex Pad. From Gold Cardex Pad, detect the Cardassian and Dominion energy signatures. Okay, let's go. The true way together with the Dominion, this can't be good. Target Are Alpha Gemidar. Uh, that is Alpha Gemidar bred in the Alpha Quadrant. Must be someone commanding them. Most likely. Okay, let's scan this facility here. Scan complete, sir. I'm detecting numerous life signs, mostly Gemadar. It appears to be some kind of manufacturing facility. Based on the presence of the presence of a large amount of yid yidrium by the uh, whatever. I am detecting along the I'm detecting along with Gemadar life signs. I would venture that this is a Ketrasol White facility. Okay, let's look for a place to beam down. I have located a cave just above the facility that should allow us to beam in undetected. Are you ready to beam down? Yes, I am. And now, because I'm already choosing the away team. Sir, we have arrived in a cave just above the facility. Sir, scans confirm that this is indeed a factory for producing Catrasol White. If we were to destroy this facility, it would be a great blow to the Alpha Gemadar and their True Way allies. A few well-placed charges could cause a chain reaction that destroys the facility. Detecting Cord Cardassian and Dominion life signs below, sir, we best be on, best be on our guard. That's all for now. One set of guards down. Okay, I'm gonna have to go this way. <laughs>
Let's place those charges and take out, take out those Jem'Hadar. Jem okay, this area is secured. The area just ahead appears to be a laboratory detecting multiple life signs at one Vorta. That is a lot of Ketrasil white there. Ew. Everything's filling up, and also, don't want the triple. You have enough troubles with triples as is. <laughs> and yes, that. But, Yes, that was kind of a b bit of a pun there, but... No, clear the list. We'll speak to the... the fort in a minute. Ow. Greetings. I am very glad to meet you. I am Naaman, a Vorta scientist, and servant of the Founders and the Dominion, of course. You're pleased to see us? Oh my, yes. I have a proposition to which I hope you shall be amenable. I serve a Founder named Loss. He is one of 100 Founders sent here to the Alpha Quadrant. His actions have placed me in a bit of a moral conundrum that I hope you can help me unravel. Okay, a Vorta with moral conundrum. Didn't realize you had morals. Loss was the first of these Alpha Quadrant founders to emerge. He located and gathered the others into a new Great Link. However, he has not seen fit to tell these founders that the war with the Dominion is over and that the Great Link is alive and well in the Gamma Quadrant. Instead, he has convinced them that you solids exterminated the Great Link, and are attempting to exterminate these Founders as well. Okay, why do you continue to serve Loss? Several reasons. First, even if I do not agree with him, he is a god. Second, he is my only link to the other Founders here. Finally, his Gem Hadar are fanatically loyal and watch me constantly. Although you seem to have mitigated that issue. Okay, if you, if you serve Laz, why have you chosen to betray him? Betrayal is such an ugly word. I prefer to think of our arrangement as a creative solution to a difficult problem. But semantics aside, I do not feel so much that I am betraying loss as liberating the other 98 Founders and serving the Dominion and the Founders. I do not believe they would want these Alpha Quadrant Founders to be ignorant of the truth. I also fear that if loss continues his plans, it could result in the death of Founders. The morphogenic virus still lives in the memory of the Dominion. Okay, what do you do here anyway? My job is to supervise the Ketracel White production. While the Gem Hadar are mighty warriors, they are not the greatest scientists, nor do we wish them to have the secret of Ketracel White production. Okay, in that case, what is this deal you propose? Loss keeps me away from the new link. They have been raised on his deceits, and so will be utterly convinced that you are attempting to exterminate them. I believe we can help each other. You can free me, and take me to the new link, where I can explain to the Founders the truth, that the Dominion still exists, and that you are not hunting them to extinction. Uh-huh. What's the catch? Oh, I do not like the word catch. It sounds so mercenary. But yes, my price is Loss's life. 
After I reveal the truth to the new Link, you must allow them to mete out their justice. I cannot jeopardize the life of a founder under any circumstances. Okay, very well, come with us. So the, the area ahead appears to be some kind of command center of Detective Cardassian and Jemadar life signs. Acknowledged. I'll be glad to get out of here. These Alpha Jem'Hadar don't understand the proper respect owed to a Vorta. Okay, I have to go this way. Intruders! I'll put up a force field! You dump the data! We've got to stop the first before he deletes all the data. Yeah, I know that. Shall retrieve the coordinates. Come on. Got work to do. Okay, I s Are you done? I have the data. It will take some time to decrypt, but I recommend we depart as quickly as possible. Agreed. Let's get out of here. Detected Cardassian and Dominion, Dominion energy signatures incoming. The charges on the surface are ready to detonate on your command. Acknowledged. And let's blow this up. Things up. 
Such a waste. That factory might have come in handy someday. Well, right now we're trying to stop th stop this, so guess what? You can always build a new one later. requested to speak with us. I have completed the decryption of the data we recovered. The new link appears to lie in the Orias system. I have transferred the coordinates to your helm. I want to thank you for your service to the Dominion. I also want to remind you of our agreement, namely that Loss, or any other founder for that matter, is not to be killed by you. I remember, Neiman. I just hope that I don't have to come to regret making that arrangement. Let's get the hell out of here. Congratulations on destroying the facility. That should cripple the Alpha Gem Hadar for the time being. But we need to make contact with this new link. Hopefully, Naaman can convince them of the truth before it's too late. Keep a close eye on him. We may have a treaty with the Dominion, but that doesn't mean I trust them. Abortus' first loyalty will always be to the Founders. Yeah. I don't need that, any of those, so I'm getting... How can Congratulations, I Commander. Where's Field Dome? That's nice. Also, I need to really upgrade those. Let's see, can I upgrade them right now? Don't have a tech upgrade. Um, before I start the next mission, I wanted one. Naaman has decrypted the coordinates for the new link. Yeah, I'll take How that. How can I help you? I'll read it after th after this. Let me. Let me. Okay, exchange. Actually, I need to go with the bank first. Which I don't really have the stuff for, so... We'll go...
into account bank. Yes, I got one of these. Come on. Let's upgrade this. And can't re upgrade this right now because my level's too low. Yeah, that's staying with me along with this. And swap for that. Also because, for those, because I'm curious because it's been years. Okay, they still sell. They're still. These are still around. I remember how I used to get a few, of the, get a couple of these, and sell them. But that's back when. Let me show you the dilithium exchange right now. When this was a little bit too high. Also, withdraw that. Oop. That's not it. But, yeah, as you can see, whole bunch of dilith. It, you, honestly, it wasn't this high before. It was around, like, say, in the 200s. Oh well, just been so long. Anyway, let's put this back at the bank. Also, because we can now, those two not yet. This we can use. And that's it for what we can do right now. Oop, actually, no. We can store this in the b store this. Ch <laughs> oh, we can't store it in the bank. Oh well. The upgrade though, yes. And now let's get to the Orias system. Betrayal wears a familiar uh. face, as infiltrators from other dimensions attempt to establish a foothold in the Bajor sector. Okay, let's just begin new link. Okay, so th that starts on July 2nd. Okay, we've arrived at the Raya system. There's an M-class planet ahead, but I'm protecting Geminar vessels within the facility. I doubt they'll allow us to reach the planet unscathed. Yep, I agree with you on that. The Gemidar will not likely be interested in negotiations. I'm will be I already figured that. <laughs> Get 
get this guy off the comms, please. Bad angle. There's those turrets. on Araya, sir. I'm detecting Gemdar life signs. We should be on our guard. Okay. You have to admire the devotion of the Gemhadar. They never seem to tire of throwing their lives away for the founders. You shut up. There it is. It's even more beautiful than I imagined. To think... My gods slumber below, dreaming in their link. You get 
move there. Okay, let's scan these containers of Catrasol White. Okay, someone to this batch of Catrasol White confirms that it was manufactured, manufactured... It's almost sacrilegious to have you here. I hope the Founders will understand the necessity and forgive me. Okay, as I was saying, it was confirmed to be manufactured in the facility on Devos. Okay, let's collect a sample for analysis. I already did. And more loot to pick up. Catch some weight. More on pickup. Okay, because I just remembered something. and act to enable. an act know that what you're reading is an act of disobedience and if you're reading this I am most like mo most likely dead we are programmed to believe that the founders are gods and are and infallible but lately I've become to question Laz's orders some of his explanations no longer make sense <clears throat> for example we have been monitoring the transmissions from the local systems and none of them have any mention of the crusade against the founders one of my brothers says he's went to a facility where Ketrosol White is manufactured. He said that there was a Forta there, but this Forta has kept almost a prisoner and does not command the Chemadar there. Still, obedience brings victory, and victory is life. Who are we to question the motives of a god? And when a god lies, is it still a lie? I'd say yeah. The other Vorta are going to be so envious when they hear about this. Let me just set up here. stuff
will speak to Have you. you come to finish the job of exterminating us, Solid? We are not here to hurt you. You have been deceived by Laws. Impossible. We have linked with Laws. He is in the link as we speak. We know all that he knows. Then he must have some way of deceiving you. It is true that he awoke before us. Let us summon him to answer these charges. We have our own witnesses as well. See, we have our own witness as well. It's true, Great One. These people are not hunting you. The Great Link remains. The Dominion has a treaty with the Alpha Quadrant species. This creature lies. You have joined with me. You then know you should all have no qualms that I know. about linking. No. These solids have poisoned your minds. I will not be forced to link by them. Come on, let me out. Okay, can't capture this one. Although it is unfortunate we had to resort to violence to force loss into his liquid form, we are grateful for your assistance. We shall now be able to link with him and learn the whole truth of our past. If you are telling the truth, you have nothing more to fear from us. But we request that you leave us in peace. We have no interest in dealing with your kind. Well, I hope at time that you could, you'll change your mind, but we'll respect your wishes. Well, it has been a pleasure knowing you. I will remain here and serve the Founders. They have been without Avorta and have much to learn about their siblings in the Gamma Quadrant. I know the Founders may seem ungrateful to you, but what can you expect from a god? Still, you have my gratitude, for whatever the gratitude of an insignificant servant is worth. Safe journey, Zeman. Let's get out of here. Yeah. <sighs>
Uh, just have to wait for it to load. Okay, sir, the Gemadar Dreadnought's warping in, they are hailing us. On screen! Oh, hello, what the hell just happened? Although you have slain our brothers, we have orders to allow you to leave the system. But you are never to return. And let it be known among your peoples that this system belongs to us, and you are not welcome. Okay, something's going on here. One second. Back on. Fear not, we shall leave you in peace. Sir, I recommend we launch a beacon to warn other ships not to approach the system. I found a good location. A course, and what the hell just happened to my... my taskbar? Okay, do I need... you have to reassign stations, great. Ian, Tarsi, Scarvin, Tamet. Weird. I'll have to fix that after this. Okay, let's launch that beacon. Okay, and let's get out of here. I can't remember if I could have motion or not in coming. Oh, well, we'll find out soon. Yep, promotion to captain. Be inhaled by Admiral Quinn. Um, actually, first, yeah, we're gonna go on screen for this. Okay, thank you, Admiral. I'll return to Earth shortly. Congratulations! You have defeated the True Way and made peace with the Alpha Changelings. I have transmitted messages to the major powers of the galaxy, advising them to avoid the Araya system. Okay. Take the Kraton torpedoes. Collect the Congratulations, rules. Captain. Oh, it is good actual, to see you. Except you this. Have any uh, continue. Or yeah, we're gonna have we're about to do the Borg advance. But before then, before that, first, no nope, wrong. Got ourselves some ships to collect. And there we go, into her space dock. Okay, let's 
let's... Okay, category... I'm a Grand Captain, yes. Okay... No... Just I have this. We we no 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 and no. And we can save that for later. Just take care of this. Done. And let's go manage ships. Okay, I can't remember. I'm checking something real quick. I. Um, just double check in here. Stuff that I already have. No, 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 no. I'm trying to remember. Okay, we'll have. We... There we go. That one has the cloaking device. That's next. Right now we're in tier f four, if I remember correctly. Yeah, tier four, I believe. So we got ourselves a Sao, Sao Paulo here, but we're gonna, but we're gonna work on this because, damn, I don't, oh, I don't like how we got just this here. <laughs> hey, get out of here. Don't need that. Nothing on there. Leave the Harping torpedo there. And we got our set, and we'll set this one for the. Set it for this one. First. We are upgrading everything else on here. Okay, let's use this shield array. There's a shield. You know what? That needs to... this... needs to go on that. And I'll head towards my bank, deposit certain things I need to go there. Like these torpedo launchers, because I can upgrade them, and I can sell them later. Trying to see what else I. Okay, I'm putting you in there. I can't equip it onto my thing yet. Oh, hello! I thought it got. Thought you were minimized. Okay, anything else? Second. Go. Yeah, 
And that's really it. For now, anyway. I just put on more stations. Leon will go there. Tarsi there. We need to fix up a certain thing. Scarvin there. Tomet. We're gonna need ourselves another engineering. Join the crew. Okay. But I have to fix those up. The attack pattern Omega 2 is fine. Those the cannons are fine also. Wanna I wanna swap this out for another one. Actually for a tactical team. Which I have right here. So yeah, skills. Stations. Tactical team. Go. We're gonna have to get some new skills for for the engineer here. And also, while we're, I'm thinking about it, the replicator for cycle. Wait, is this one bound? Yeah, bound to character. Okay. Whole bunch of stuff we have to recycle. Actually, retrieve that shield recharge thing. Back to recycling. At the Horta. Just stuff to recycle. So it's not even worth anything. <laughs> Discard all of that. Also, let's upgrade it. This, that is. That's upgraded to as best as I can right now. I'm trying to think what else I need to do here. Let's see if there's any any weapons we can upgrade our ship with. Okay, where are you? Weapons, weapons, ship equipment. Nope, that's not it, it's... Oh, there you are, ship weapons. Okay. Okay, phaser, dual... Heavy. Let's go with Captain. Oh. I don't like it. That's expensive. I'll just have to live with what I have then.
Okay. Let's access the bank, deposit some stuff I'm ba that's basically taking up room. You, you, you. I don't want the data recorder. Deposit you, deposit you, deposit you. I know this is a bit boring right this second, but I need to do a little bit of inventory management because it's kind of needed. Just in case I need a melee weapon anytime soon. Those infinity boxes don't really need them. Somehow missed that. Always keep the fire suppression device. Okay. Actually, before I do. Want to look at something real quick? No, 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 not skills. So wait, station skills would be attack pattern Omega Three. Ah, oh. luckily it's cheap. I need to promote everyone here. Yeah, I learned that. anyone else? Nope. And now it's a case of getting another engineering team and something else. Welcome back, Yoza. Well, we, well, in case you're wondering what you missed, we got ourselves promoted to captain. Okay. Basically, what? I, basically, Reader's Digest promoted to captain. Got done with another arc. Greetings. How can I assist you today? Okay. Get the get everything here. Which means we'll have a whole bunch of stuff.
It's just basically a rank up. Right now I'm just gathering all the stuff here from the recruits from the recruit stuff that's account wide unlock. That I can anyway. basically will give me marks for stuff. There's some bonus R&D pool. Okay, we got ourselves a photonic engineer. More reputation and mark choices. Which we really don't... Hold on. There we go. Whole bunch of random stuff. Let me just I'm swapping out the the pets here and let me just install the temporal negotiator, which reduces bridge officer powers by fifty percent for time for recharge time. Okay, I need another round. There's another engineering team, and let's put it for let's go with directed energy modulation. Because I can't use these yet. Because, see, a fifth, level 50 can't use them. Till then. Okay. Advanced rapid support. Just taking a quick look to see if there's anything else. Not yet, so... Oh, come on! Chad popped up again. Okay, Yoza. Okay. It is good to see you. I have to go back to Deep Space Nine. Approach Deep Space Nine. Take care of the journal. Oh, need to take care of this real quick.
Okay, get. You know what? Let's just bring it up to ten here. That way we could get everything all set and said and done. Oop, we forgot to take care of the engineer here. Seven along with you. Wrong one. Attack pattern Omega three breaks for impact. The cannons. Hazard emitters. Turret. Photon torpedo. You there. This one must be the rear. Yep. Okay, red matter capacitor is already there. Rotate shield frequency, tactical team, tactical team. Torpedo, tractor beam. Bot phaser cannons. Dual heavy phaser cannons. That's really it. Kind of have to do a little bit of cleanup up here. Oh, I forgot evasive maneuvers. And there we go. Back to three because that's all I need. Beam onto DS9. Okay, where do I? Oh, other side. <laughs> Wait a second. Oh. I'm gonna customize my ship real quick. Goes up. No. And I don't want the adamant. Give me the defiant. Though the pylons. Okay, actually, I want to see what the Vigilant Refit looks like. No, that costs money, which I don't want. Actually, I want to see the mirror. Nope. Looks nice, but no. Stick with the Defiant. Although, I am going to go with the Sao Paulo... The cells for it. Okay, apply, and there we go. Wait, I forgot the bridge portion. Where is the one that I was thinking of? Not classic.
I'm trying to find where it is, the one that I'm thinking of. There, Pioneer. Because why not? Go. So you swap out the... Don't want the fur down there. Okay, you asked to see me? Yes, I did. I was informed by Starfleet Command that you are eligible for inclusion into Military Assault Command Operations, otherwise known as MAKO. We are the thin line that separates the Federation from Ruination. It is our job to take on the most impossible tasks and make them possible. Special task forces aren't for everyone. But the rewards, for those who can complete them, are worth the effort. From what I hear, you and your ship are more than up to the task. Okay. Completing my missions won't be easy, but I and my officers will do all I can to help you. You will earn the finest weapons and armor that the Alpha Quadrant has to offer. You will be able to outfit your ship with equipment that will make you the envy of your fellow officers. Even special personnel or resources will be available to you. Good luck. You're going to need it. Do you have any questions? Nope. Let's... It okay, is good no, to see you. That's not it. Borg have been located in the Beta Quadrant. A fleet has already begun massing. The Klingon Defense Force also has a fleet in the area, and we have agreed to share the system for the defense of the Alpha Quadrant. Report immediately to four of ten. She is a okay. liberated Borg stationed on the USS Victory, who has been providing us with strategic okay, information. Yeah, that, yeah, that's saying something different than what it was saying, so we're gonna follow the instructions on the follow the instructions on the thing and not not what he's saying. Do do do, come on, load up. Thank you. <laughs> this is the greatest plan. Okay, port to the ambassador. Captain, okay. The Talshar has gone too far. Their experience with the Borg, with Borg technology not only put us at risk by, provi by provoking a hostile force, but also put all of us at risk for being assimilated if one of their scientists make even one mistake. Yeah, I agree. Congratulations, Captain. Next up. Okay, I need a capable ship to check on reports of Borg activity in the Bur Burgess system. The Baltic is more important, more than up to the task, and I know you have previous experience with the Collective. Okay, yeah, ba fake backstory, thank you very much, Daniels. There is no better officer for this test, stay alert. There have been reports of other ships in the regions, including the Tal Shiar. The Burgess system is well out of, the, well out of Romulan space, I'd like to know what their purpose is out there. Okay, to the Burgess system. Bur Burgess system. 
I'm just transwarping there. Once thought to be an unstoppable force, the Borg would dealt a heavy... Yeah, I don't want to hear... Sorry. Sorry, I don't want to hear it. I but want to get... the Borg are nothing if not resilient. This is they Commander retreated, Talus of the waited, Romulan Star Empire planned, vessel, Oranay. And they adapted. We are under attack by Borg scouts. These orders. are not the nightmares of Wolf 359. From any ship receiving they are this faster, message. aggressive, not relentless, remorseless. Okay, we'll, ex we'll assist. What the Borg cannot assimilate, they will destroy. seen that one before. I'm just used to seeing cubes. <laughs> Not that. RW RNA. My ship has been attacked and disabled by the Borg. My crew are being assimilated. The self-destruct is offline. I have retreated with my surviving officers to the main science lab. If you can hear this, I formally request assistance. If there is no one who can respond to this message, then may we die with honor. We're on our way, Commander. Hold on as, as long as you can. Thank you for coming to our assistance. Borg drones have beamed aboard the RNA and are attempting to assimilate my crew. Several of us have barricaded ourselves in the science lab. We need your assistance to prevent our ship from being assimilated and to save the rest of the crew. Stay put, we're on our way. Okay. Yeah, I know what that means. That means I have to break out the buckshot. Says this is physical damage and not and not any other kind. Because physical damage does more to the Borg. And Ahead. Use the console in sick bay to override the security protocols. these prisoners. Thank you so much for saving us. The Tal Shiar were using us as test subjects in their experiments with Borg technology. Only a few of us survived their investigations. I know that they'll do anything to preserve their empire. And I've seen with my own eyes what they and the Alachi did to the outlying colonies. But I didn't think they would be this cruel to their own people. Don't worry, you're safe now. Okay, where's the... There it is. The Borg have disabled 
of the force fields guarding the science lab. We managed to fend off the first wave, but we need your help. Get to the lab and stop the remaining drones. We'll leave George's lab now, Commander. Ugh, can't go that way. To take the long way. Drones incoming. Destroy them before they reach the research equipment. Okay. Go paradox corrected. Scanner show no further Borg presence aboard. Thank you for your aid, but I must ask you to return to your ship at once. Our research here is critical to the survival of the Romulan Star Empire, and I cannot share these secrets, even with our rescuers. Okay, what exactly are you trying to hide? We are studying salvaged Borg devices. Bear in mind that this technology is now the sovereign property of the Romulan Star Empire. My engineers tell me that our engines are online. So your further presence aboard my ship is neither necessary nor desirable. For your own safety, I advise you to leave and to forget what you have seen here. Spin back. Take their stuff if I can. Long range sensors show a Borg squadron approaching at speed. Essential repairs to our singularity drive are almost complete. If you can occupy the Borg and give us the time we need, I will overlook your intrusion on our classified research. Well, I don't want you to have any, so we'll be taking that Borg technology with us. Energize the transporters. How dare you! You take advantage of my ship's vulnerability. But you cannot escape the wrath of the Tal Shi'ar. Do not think that your actions today will go unpunished. We will find you. And when we do, you will return what you have taken. With well, interest. Blah, blah, blah. is online. Our scanners show more ships approaching. I hope you enjoy the spoils of your theft. Enjoy defending them from the Borg, that is. We are responding to a distress call from an IRW RNA. 
Normally we wouldn't provide assistance to the Tal Shi'ar, but the Borg are a threat to all of us. However, you appear to have things well in hand. Do you require assistance? Yes, Commander. Any assistance you provide would be helpful. try to escape with the property of the Romulan Star Empire. Lower your shields and prepare to be boarded. Not a chance in hell. Red alert. We should leave here as soon as possible. Borg and the Talshar. I can't think of a worse combination. We knew the Talshar had an interest in Borg technology, but I thought Starfleet and the Republic had put a stop to their research. Now we know that they're still working with stolen collective tech. We'll have to be vigilant. Thank you, Captain. With this won't be the last encounter with the Borg, but I know you're ready for whatever comes next. Congratulations, Captain. Okay, I'm just double checking here. Yep. It's that one. Captain, what do you know about the Borg nanovirus? The Borg aren't just assimilated individuals anymore, they found a way to assimilate entire areas. They infect the, techno infect the technology, the water, the flora, and even the air. After that, it's only a matter of time till the planet, entire planet is Borg. If this process is, is allowed to continue unchecked, they'll assimilate the entire sector, and from there they could assimilate the Federation. Starfleet had a team working on a counter agent on Omicron Kappa 2. We lost contact with them and with the entire planet, and we fear that the nanovirus escaped contain con a confinement and affected the planet. Hold on. I'm just I need to check something. I heard thought I heard something.
sorry about that, everyone. I thought I heard my dad shout something, so... But it was just a case of... case of... I think it was the microwave door closing. Okay, yeah, we'll just basically... Auto-navigate there. Just so you know, we're, I'm hitting the ad play ads button because we're getting close to the end of the stream and we don't want to be inter interrupted by ads, excuse me. So, see you after the break. Do 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 do. Also gives me a chance to clean up the stuff here. Okay, out of there. Undo. Get back here. That gets discarded, though. Yeah. Better shield. He was a a quantum torpedo for the rear one. It's doing some other stuff. Nope. Want that for that. Okay, I'm just Check in here. Yeah, I'm trying to remember the skills I need. Okay, I made a little bit of mistake. I believe I have to Okay, I'll have to use a retrain token. But that'll be for later. Okay, welcome back everyone. Just about there. Gonna gather in darkness. Omicron Capitu has been largely assimilated by the Borg and their use of the planet as a hub for their ships in the area. They're sure to be aware of our presence. However, we're picking up an emergency signal for the service. That means the research team has. Um, that may mean the research team may not have been assimilated yet. We want to send a way team down to find the research team. First, we need to do is take out the is engage support patrols and find a safe location for our orbit.
Orbital strike, nice. Just what I need. Additional patrols on our sensor, sir, but we are detecting high concentration of Borg on the planet's surface. We're also picking up the energy signature of a large data node, which means the collect which means the Borg have connected the entire planet to the collective. Starfleet believes that the research team can be saved and that they may have the information uh, we need to formulate a treatment that could save multiples, multitudes from the Borg nanovirus. The away team is ready to leave on your command. Let's beam down. Sir, sensors are detecting numerous Borg life signs and a few non-Borg life signs ahead. Recommend we proceed with caution. Knowledge, stay alert. Okay. Ooh, saved the scientist. And lockbox. Hate those lockboxes. And we don't need you, so move you over. Thank you. Your arrival could not have been more timely. My fellow researchers are still at our camp and require your assistance. There are Borg in the area. Stay behind us, we'll handle the Borg. There's the camp head. Sir, sensors are detecting numerous Borg life signs headed this way. Recommend we prepare to defend the area. Okay. You wonder why they haven't assim why have they adapted yet? Captain, we are receiving requests for transport from scientists on the surface. Yeah, beam them up. Thanks for the rescue. My name is Dr. Eric Cooper. My team and I were researching the Borg nanovirus. It's fascinating. The Borg have been using it to assimilate entire planets, the land, the buildings, the people. Anyway, during the course of our research, the nanovirus containment failed. The nanovirus activated and assimilated enough equipment to signal the collective. We cannot allow the Borg to continue using this nanovirus. I think we have enough data to formulate a counteragent, but we'll need to recover it from the area that's already assimilated. That's why I stayed behind. I can get you inside the compound, but then it will be up to you to recover the data. Can I count on your assistance? Yeah, th there's too much stake to refuse that. Thank so. you. I'm in your debt. As is the entire Alpha Welcome quadrant. back, Yoza. Lead the way to the force field. Okay, I'm still surprised I haven't had to... Did, had to had to remodulate my weapons. I'm right now just doing the campaign because I still have to level up.
Okay, need to set up some defenses because. Come on, Cooper! You have to start running! So Overridden the force fields, but the Borg detected the intrusion into their systems. They'll know you're coming. Head into the facility and locate the central data node. We don't have time to search for the right files, so simply transfer all the information to your ship's computer and hold off the Borg until the transfer is complete. I'll stay here. I'd probably just get in your way. Okay, drop the force field and then get out of sight. We'll get the data. Data transfer. Undine? Oh, great. There. Yeah, that's not my orbital strike. idea. Uh, uh -oh. Ooh, 
That's not good. I need you back here. Undine troops are beaming down. They're focusing on the board, but they'll find me soon. Yeah, time to run. Good idea? No, I don't think so, but hey. It looked like the board just abducted that Undine. But that's pointless. Undine can't be assimilated. Unless... The Borg must believe they have found a way to assimilate the Undine. We have to stop them. There's probably too much interference to transport. But there are some pattern enhancers nearby. Those should help us get back to your ship. Okay, follow us. Let's beam out of here. Oh, don't worry, she'll be fine. Just knocked out. Ow. Well, they're also known, um, the Undine are also known as Species 8472 by the Borg. The, they, the Borg tried to assemble, the first time they came out was in Star Trek Voyager. They were trying to assimilate, they were being, or say, at least they attempted to assimilate the, um, be assimilated by the Borg, but it didn't really work out for the, work out for the Borg, and, well, the Borg were turning tail and running until the USS Voyager decided to interfere and, well, the Borg are still around. Okay, Captain, the Borg, the Borg Sphere is escaping with the Undine captive. If they are able to return to the Collective and assimil assimilate it, just imagine what, what, what they could do with Undine drones. Looks like the sphere is being pursued by an Undine ship. Lay in a pursuit, pursuit course. Come on. Uh oh. What are you doing? Well, now. Okay. The Borgster has gone to warp, and I've followed. And. Sir, followed. Or they followed by the undeep ship. I was able to isolate their warp signature. We should be able to follow their trail. We should report back to Starfleet and then follow them. I never imagined the Undine would destroy an entire world to prevent the spread of the Borg. Many lives here were lost today, Captain, but even more were saved. Let's get out of here. We've recovered much of the data related to the counteragent to the Borg nanovirus, and with it, the and with the plan now destroyed, hopefully the Borg did not have an opportunity to adapt to it. The Borg will adapt to time, of course, but we must stay one step ahead of them. Yes, we must. And let's go with that. Congratulations, Captain. Okay, now, and we got ourselves what I'm setting up this for next stream. Capture the Undine vessel you were tracking from Omicron Kappa 2 um, has been sighted near NGC 4447. The Borg ship has also Borg ships have also been detected in this area. While there are no populated systems 
uh, um, in danger there, we still need to know why the Borg and the Undine have escalated their conflict now. Go find the Borg sphere that took the Undine from from that took the Undine, and the answers will that we need will be there. Oh, we also get ourselves the prosthetic parts. <laughs> And let me. I'm just seeing. Okay. I'll take the maintenance drone part. <laughs> and also. Auto navigate. And after that. We'll, after that, we'll call it the end of the stream. Once we get there. But yeah. I just want to double check something here in the. In the journal. This is the second to last last one in the Borg Advance here. After that it will be the new Romulus arc. But yeah, I thought I was going to take a little bit more oops, wrong I thought it was going to be taking more time with the Kardashian, Kardashian struggle, and, um, in order to, but I'm surprised it was a little bit short, <laughs> in my opinion. And we're stopping here. Okay. Well, I thank you all for tuning in. I hope you had had fun watching the stream as I as I did playing, and I hope you're all ha are having a good good day or night or whatever. First, um, first before we go, if any of you are interested in watching more of my content, hit that heart icon down below. This is my schedule: uh, MechWare Online on Fridays, Battletech Advance 362 on Mondays, and any game of my choosing on Tuesdays, unless something gets gets delayed. <laughs> or it gets moved around. All streams start at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I have a Twitter account. I post whenever I go live there, whenever anything interesting pops into my mind. So if you want to follow, go there. I also have a Discord server. If you want to hang out there, just click on that, just click on that link, you'll bring you right there. Okay, try to and also, if you want, if you, also, if you, whenever I go live, I post it there too. Ooh. I know, I know we're done with this, but we're going to be raiding someone. Let me just set it up here real quick. Says right now they are streaming. They're streaming a different game, just so you know. They're streaming a game called Snow Runner. So let me just set. Also, I'm gonna set up a raid message. One second. <laughs> One second. Let me just. Okay, come on. Go away, you pop-up. This is what we're going to be using as a message. Anyway, let's go with the raid. Anyway, I thank you all for tuning in. Please, stay safe out there. Bye, everybody. Now let's go raid. <laughs>